Lucy, thank you. New at 10. It's a story we first brought to you in April. Black mold, bugs, and faulty pipes at Emory Gardens apartment complex. Some residents say they still have not seen changes. Craig Andrus has been following this story and tonight learned what some city leaders are doing to get it fixed. That's right. You know, this is the second time I've been out to Emory Garden Apartments in South Wichita recently and residents today, some of them tell me they're still dealing with health issues because of black mold. They say that hasn't all been removed. I also talked to one city council member out to change city code to get something done. Back in April, some city council members visited Emory Garden Apartments in South Wichita after complaints about bugs, roaches, and black mold in some units. It's disgusting living in my apartment, and I begged and pleaded for pest control to come. Jerrica says pest control has not showed up at her apartment, even after asking for management, to fix issues with different apartments in her building that have black mold. She says she's now trying to find another place to live after documenting the issues, and she's not alone. Back in April, we had talked to Sarah Hagee, who had black mold in the apartments below hers. She says work has started to remove the mold, but her family health issues persist. Sinus stuff. She just went to the doctor yesterday. Our roommates are now sick with the same issue that my daughter was sick with when we first moved in here. Guess and reached out to managers again who said the manager could be reached next Monday. The request is simple. It's, it's not to really do damage to them. It's just to make sure that people have decent living conditions. City Council Member Brandon Johnson talking to city legal and the city manager about getting black mold added to the city code to require apartment owners to remediate black mold. City Council Member Johnson also hopes to have something added to that city code within a month to force more accountability. One resident today, Sarah, that you saw in the story says apartment managers have started some of that remediation, but says much more is needed soon. Here for you, Craig Andrus, KSN News 3.